Hi, I'm Catherine McMahon. I'm Head of Exhibitions at the Australian War Memorial and I'm also the Project Manager of the redevelopment of our Hall of Valour. The Hall of Valour tells the stories of Australian soldiers who've been awarded the Victoria Cross from the very beginning of the Boer War right through to Afghanistan today. Effectively, it's about brave soldiers and their personal stories. It, of course, also displays the medals that they were awarded for their actions, their brave deeds. It used to be much smaller. We had a far smaller collection of Victoria Crosses. As the collection grew, the space grew, and so it now sits in the very centre of the Australian War Memorial. Right above it is the Tomb of Our Unknown Soldier and the Hall of Memory. So symbolically, you could say it's the heart of the Australian War Memorial. When we briefed the designers, the one thing that we're after is to create a dignified space, something that would inspire visitors. And the way they've interpreted that is they've used quite noble materials. So the Australian War Memorial building is built out of sandstone, and so we're actually using sandstone quarried from exactly the same place as the original fabric, and we're using a lot of other noble materials to create a certain ambience in the space. The Hall of Valour is different because it talks about individuals. It's about the personal stories, about these, these men who did very brave things and were awarded Australia's highest decoration. Of course, we use personal stories in our other exhibitions, but we also tend to tell a little bit more military history, whereas this one is less so about the military history and, and more about the individuals. If you come to the Australian War Memorial to our new Hall of Valour, you will see one of the world's largest collections of Victoria Crosses on display.